Hey what's up everybody it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks and today I'm going to show you how to make Android's clock app open directly to the alarm tab. Now the basic clock app on Android devices is functional and has a few nice features. One of these is a world clock view which lets you see the current time in different cities across the world and shows the time in your location at the top. But of course the local time in your area is already displayed in the status bar at the top of any screen. So when you open the clock app, chances are you're not looking to see the time. More than likely, you open your clock app mainly to set an alarm. If that's the case, you should check out the latest exposed module from Developer Money too. It's a simple module really, because all it does is make your clock app open to the alarm tab directly. To get this one going, you'll need to be rooted with the exposed framework installed on your device. But if you need any help with those requirements, just check out my article on Gadget Hacks. Now this may not work on all devices, but most should be supported. I tried it on my Lollipop devices though, and I found that it didn't work. Just a heads up. But to get started, head to the download section of your exposed installer app and search Desk Clock Alarm. Then tap the top result. From here, swipe over to the Versions tab, then hit the download button next to the most recent entry. Within a few seconds, Android's installer interface should come right up, so tap Install on this screen. When that's finished, you'll get a notification from Exposed telling you that the module hasn't been activated yet and that a reboot is needed. Just tap the Activate and Reboot button on this notification and Exposed will take care of the rest for you. When you get back up, no further setup is needed. Just open your Clock app and the Alarm tab will be in view immediately. So for most users, this module gets straight to the point since your clock app now opens to the tab that you probably wanted to use in the first place. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!